close your eyes and watch your breath. Try to stay with the breath as continuously as you can. Otherwise, if you jump around, there's a lot of things you miss. If you want to see how one thing leads to another, you have to stick with it until it's led to that other thing. You don't just make a little note and then jump away someplace else and come back and check every now and then. Because the actions of the mind have a long flow like this. And so you want to be with the present moment as continuously as you can so you can see that connection. Otherwise, you just make guesses. You saw this, a little glimpse of that, and a glimpse of this, and you start stitching things together. And sometimes it may be correct, but a lot of times you've missed a lot of things. It's like connect the dots. You can take the same set of dots and you can make a bird out of them, you can make a plane, you can make a tree. You can make all kinds of things. Depends on what you're looking for. But if you want to see what's actually there, you want to have more than just dots. You want to see what the whole lines are to begin with. And that requires that you learn how to stay here steadily. So learn how to resist any temptation to go off. If the, learn how to read the mind, to know when it's beginning to send out feelers in different directions to see where else it might go. And firm up your intention that you're really going to stay here instead. The mind does send signals like this, so you want, want to be alert to them. They talk about how people will have an impulse to do something and not really be conscious of it until it's already underway. Well, that's because they're not really paying attention. The more closely you pay attention, the quicker you are to realize, oh, this impulse is coming, it's going to force you to do this or that if you act on it. So the mind has to be a lot more honest with itself. We're used to covering things up. So now you want to be clear about where the mind wants to go, what it wants to do, and deal with it in time. Because you really do want to develop this skill of being able to stay with something continuously. That's only when you see it all the way through. 